deep in the crease once again for the last delivery. And they're going to push for two. It's Archer. They're brave. And it's a direct. Oh, no. Wade's gone up. Everyone's gone up. We'll go upstairs. That can't have happened. <laughs> that cannot have happened. He can't believe well, himself. It could possibly. Well, Short and Archer have been the two big guns for the Hurricanes in every game. So it's a ricochet off the batsman. There's going to be wide. The ball hits the batsman. No, he's going to be all right. <laughs> so that deflected off the sliding mm. batsman there. His pad. He's been stiff. He's all right, that. The way Archer's going tonight and <laughs> the Hurricanes, you wouldn't be surprised if that was a direct and given out. But Bat was down as the ball ricocheted off Ross. Off his arm, wasn't it? been told that they are checking for obstructing the field here, which I find quite difficult to believe. Okay, so the bats, the, the batters are not allowed to change their line. Once they get set on a line, they cannot waver off that. You can see Ross coming back in line with the stumps. So if that's the case, this could easily be given out then. So the batter's not allowed to get between the thrower and the ball and the stumps in a run-out opportunity. This is what the umpires are trying to decide on. This is he interesting. He wasn't looking at the ball. He knew where the ball was, though. He, he knew, the knew the area. I think he was trying to get out of the way of the ball, trying to run away from it. So it's whether or not look, the umpire's he hasn't, deciding. He hasn't, for me, he hasn't turned and looked where the line of the throw was. He knew the general vicinity that the throw was coming from, but he's, look, tell me he's purposely got in the way of that ball. I, I don't think so. Well, he wouldn't have ducked. He would have actually stood up if he was. So let, there's no worry about the fact that he made his ground. That's certainly the case. However, what we're just judging on is whether or not Alex Ross made the decision to get between the ball and the stumps to save himself from getting run out. Matthew Wade appealing for the run out or potentially appealing for the obstruction. That's something we might be able to ask. So a different one here at the Gabba. Let's have Here's a look the at decision. This. It's interesting. Very interesting. I've got a bad feeling here. Yeah, not out. Not out for sure. Okay. Still some decisions to be made. Yeah. Oh, it's been given. My goodness. Told you. Oh, I'm Would you bad. believe it? Everyone is and stunned in the commentary box. About that. I cannot believe that. Alex Ross has been given out obstruction of field. Is the crowd has just one? realised it as well. Oh, Not I'm run out, obstruction of field. We've got Matty Wade out in the middle. Wade, I'm just out of interest. Were you appealing just for the sort of the regulation run out or did that obstruction of the field come into mind? I actually don't know what I was appealing for. I was just excited at hit the stumps yeah. off, <laughs> off his back, to be honest. I have, what, is it run out or...? It's... Uh, obstructing the field actually because oh, okay. he had made his ground by the time the stumps were broken yeah. but they've deemed that he changed direction intentionally i can't hear anything the credit yeah, no worries, mate. <laughs> well, the, the more i look at that replay sorry boss the more i look at that replay i reckon he's just trying to get out of the way of the ball at the last minute 